In this video, I'm going to talk about the posterior lateral drawer test for posterior lateral rotatory instability of the elbow. The hand and wrist of the patient are fixated between the examiner's upper arm and body. Fixate the humerus on its most distal part with your left hand, with the thumb on the posterior surface over the triceps tendon. Grasp the forearm with your right hand, with the index and middle fingers along the anterior aspect of the proximal radius and the thumb on the subcutaneous border of the ulna. Apply a posterior laterally rotatory force to the proximal radius with the fingertips of the right hand while holding the humerus stationary with the other hand. Subluxation is usually maximal between 20 to 40 degrees of flexion. The test is repeated at various angles from 0 to 90 degrees. This test is positive by a visible posterior subluxation of the radial head and dimpling of the skin between the radial head and the capitellum. 